232 days of exploring, the state-of-the-art vessel berthed at a wharf, specially used for marine geological studies in Dongguan City, South China's Guangdong province. <laughs> Setting off last July and traveling nearly 70,000 kilometers, the ship conducted research in polar regions as well as their oceans and deep seas. Haiyang 6 traveled across the Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, the Southern Ocean, and the area surrounding the Antarctic Peninsula. The longest voyage with the largest crew, covering the largest operation area. Haiyang 6 set many new records. It was the first time that Haiyang 6 launched a geological survey in the South Pacific, where it discovered new rare earth and rich sediments. Uh, it's truly a treasure. Someone even called it black gold in deep ocean, as it has many, many metallic and rare earth elements. Its metal content is even higher than that of most minerals on land. More notably, it made its maiden appearance in the South Pole. Due to advanced geological survey equipment, Haiyang 6 managed to acquire highly precise three-dimensional topographies of the seabed, covering some 20,000 square kilometers in the polar region, providing accurate water depth data for future scientific research and navigation throughout the area. Zheng Chunying, CGTN.